I would love to know from your own experience what you feel are the benefits of having diversity in the workplace. I think diversity is super important because it makes everything a little bit more enjoyable. Coming to work, interacting with your colleagues, you get so many interesting stories from all the different people based on different cultures, the different language, race, religion, sex. I mean, everything uh, just comes into play and gives you so much more value. Of course, having a good social bonding on your workplace, having people you can identify with, people who can challenge your opinions, your views, that is in itself important. But also having the diverse workforce that we have also on Plan Day, it gives you better results, bottom line. I'm not saying that because I've read it somewhere. I'm saying it because I've felt it, I've seen it. And I'm dead sure that the more diverse and inclusive we become, the better results we will see, bottom line. So that's why I'm actively pursuing this within my role in Plan Day also. It is super important that we do all these things in order to secure a diverse recruitment because in the recruitment part it's the first time a future employee uh, kind of gets acquainted with with plan day mm. and at that point if we don't have a diverse approach to them we just tend to scare off a lot of people and that's super important potential that we could have gotten but we didn't get because they might even they might have read our job description and decided no it's not really me for women, a lot of job descriptions that are very focused on performance or bottom line results mm. tend to be a bit scary for them, right? And I don't think a lot of people, maybe today more, care about that and think about how to write their job descriptions. But just a few years back, a lot of people had no clue about this. And it was written by a lot of men because it's a male dominated business. And it still is today, even though the numbers have aligned uh, become a little bit better in towards the, the female gender, but I still think it's a thing that you have to fight consciously. You have to be aware of how you, your tone of voice, how you phrase your job descriptions, and, and what it is you're looking for, how to describe it in a way so it becomes interesting, inclusive, instead of very fact-based, which we see a lot of job descriptions have today.